What is up guys welcome back to another video now in today's video we are going to be taking a look at omega rom 3.0 for our galaxy s7 and s7 edge and as you can see i have s7 edge and if you don't already know what omega rom is it's like some grandfather level shit this rom is such an old rom like not an old rom it's been rebuilt for our galaxy s7 edge. but this rom has been continued through the generations of the s series since like i can remember galaxy s3 but since the touch width redefined itself and it got more and more stocker the customizations are not the same as before literally i can remember the galaxy s4 omega rom with the galaxy s5 like base was the best highly customizable rom you can ever find for that device literally it has so many mods so let's just take a look at the rom as you can see you have a beautiful omega wallpaper over here we will check on that later on but as you can see you get a stock grace ux base with some galaxy setup such as bixby yep very useful app asset launcher and asset weather widget as you can see but you get some omega apps such as adb or wi-fi these are some developer thing is if you want to pull your system apps and do anything over adb you can do it now over the wi-fi you get the apk exporter you can directly export your system apps and share it over the wi-fi direct or anything that you can share as you can see share app package you can share it over bluetooth wi-fi and everything also the apps are nicely themed you can see the bright orange color through the camera cpu stats also another bright colored app as you can see gives you all of the information for your cpu going over here in its scripts i have some fast booting scripts with the omega droid now this is the main app i can't remember but he was one of the first to review this roms back in the day but as you can see omega articles over here omega 3.0 for galaxy s7 and s7 edge omega 2.0 omega 3.0 for galaxy s8 wow you have their pinterest tumblr twitter facebook google plus then you get the omega wallpapers and i do love these wallpapers they are very nicely done and the list just goes on and on one of them i can remember from the kitkat days from the galaxy s4 and lastly you get the omega files which is the main sheet for your phone as you can see you can also get the pro now you get the option to select your devices over here galaxy s8 galaxy s7 i think it goes way down to wow galaxy s2 i was wrong it's older than i think but we choose for the galaxy s7 omega no cut and you have some customization i'm not telling that it doesn't have any but just the battery mode scrolling catch reboot menu that's not the actual mods i will show you the galaxy s4 later on you get the bootloaders boot animations modems utilities if i go to the galaxy s4 once you will be mad blown if i go to the mods there is a shit ton of mods over here as you can see modems and stuff just filled with mods and that's pretty much it it's basically the stock race which you would get on your galaxy s7 and s7 edge nothing new over here so guys thanks for watching this was a quick little review of the omega 3.0 hope you guys enjoyed and be sure to subscribe down there for more galaxy s7 videos see you in the next one peace